In today's Madden 21 tip breakdown, I'm going to be breaking down how to torch the cover three with a very nice flood concept from the gun bunch in the Carolina Panthers offensive playbook. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you so much for taking the time to watch today's YouTube video. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, what my channel is basically doing is we basically give out free Madden 21 tips and tricks every single day here on YouTube. Uh, normally we put out four tips a day so make sure you're subscribed at the bottom right hand corner and most of the time we're trying to give you food to chew on different tips different strategies different breakdowns different concepts that you can apply to your own scheme to help you become a better madam player and uh, i just released my text message membership video for this week now if you don't know what my text message membership is basically it's a free uh, deal where essentially all you do is you text in if you have a Madden question you can ask it if you don't have any questions just text in and let me know your name so that I can get you saved in my phone and then uh, every single week we put together exclusive tips for people uh, who are part of that texting membership so we've done big nickel over G run defense we've done a big nickel over G pass defense we've done a uh, gun cluster e guide we've done a Minnesota Vikings guide and this week we're doing a gun bunch guide. Um, the video that we put together is over an hour and uh, I think it's over about an hour um, long. Most of those videos are typically a little bit longer. I get really, really in depth. And so if you're looking to get those high level Madden tips, tips I would highly encourage you to text me. My number is 812-216-3644. Um, uh, my number is also in the top left hand corner of the screen and it is also in the description of this video. All right, guys, so Gun Bunch Offset, and the play we're going to be taking a look at is Smash Return. Now, this play is very unique. It's got some great routes this year, and I just mainly wanted to show you what this can do for you against a, uh, any Cover 3 defense that you might be facing. So we're just going to come out in uh, just a standard Cover 3, and we're going to work through Cover 3 and Cover 3 Cloud and just show you um, really what this – I mean, this is just an amazing uh, route combination. Now, what I'm going to do as a general rule when you're running the Gun Bunch – you want to be running the gun bunch to the wide side of the field. So the trips receivers to the wide side of the field ball on the left hash. And basically all we're going to do, the only adjustment that you need to do on this play is take Godwin and put him on a streak. And then we're going to motion snap Brown out about uh, three steps. And what you'll see is against the cover three, this is an absolute laser one play touchdown. It's going to glitch out the deep third on the outside. The outside third is going to take the corner out leaving that streak in a one-on-one -on -one with the safety and the safety can't get there in time. And with that pass lead elite ability, you're going to be able to just torch it. Now I would highly recommend using a quarterback that has pass lead elite or a quarterback that has gunslinger because it's going to significantly help with the passing uh, speed of the ball and just getting the ball there on time. As you can see here, you want to make sure that once that uh, outside third corner goes, you can easily torch that, that safety. Now, the cool part about this is this works fairly similarly uh, against the Cover 3 Cloud. So let me show you um, this route com combination here. And what's really nice about it is you actually have some really good reads in case they're not in Cover 3. But you'll see the same thing uh, happens here. This one's a little bit more tender uh, because it takes, it takes that deep safety a little bit longer to uh, press down. Now, one thing you could do, let me test this out live, but I'm pretty sure that you can put him on a fade as well. Um, it just needs to be a vertical route, uh, and what you'll see here is this is going to give him, I'll just allow him to get a little bit more of a step to the right, as you can see against that cover three cloud. Um, but basically, you know, that vertical route, uh, I also like this against cover two. So if they run cover two on you, you can uh, put him on a deep streak against that cover two. And as long as, as long as Levante David is their user, and typically he will be, what that's basically going to mean is he is going to probably jump to the in route uh, in a situation like this. So you snap the ball, and what you'll see is this middle of the field is now completely wide open, and you can hit that route against the cover two. So you can beat cover two, and you can beat cover three with this run one with this one specific route. Now, what they are going to do to be able to stop this, and we'll just show you, um, they're going to deep half their outside corner. So I'm going to go ahead and just deep half everybody on the outside. And you're going to see that it's going to help quite a bit. As you can see there, Davis is not able to get torched and he's able to get back on the ball. However, this presents a really, really big problem for the defense. Because if they do something like that, you'll notice that we don't have a flat route. Most of the time from Gun Bunch, you see flat routes. Well, we have this little whip route and we're going to motion them out to the numbers. 
what you're going to see happen is he is going to pull down every zone and you're going to be able to throw that tight end route in behind it for a huge gain. You're still going to be gaining, um, you know, 30 to 50 yards in this one route combination. And this is very, very consistent. Again, if they deep half that outside outside corner, uh, basically you're going to see, oh, he's dropping back. Okay, I'm going to step up and I'm going to hit my tight end. And my tight end is, is going to get a shot at a huge, huge gain. So this is one of the best plays in the gun bunch. One of the more slept on plays, uh, I think, this year. I haven't seen a ton of people running this. I've seen a lot of flood. I've seen a lot of double posts. But this is one of those plays that is just a really, really, really good route combination from the gun bunch this year, especially if you want something that's very, very consistent against cover three. I love this route concept against cover three. And obviously you have your check down read, uh, which would be your in route to the left. And then you could even put your running back on a ghost route or a flat pattern. And you'll find that these ghost routes are actually really, really effective at pulling zones down to open up windows to throw the routes in behind them. But anyways, guys, that is a uh, cover three beater. Really good route combination that you can use out of the shotgun bunch to beat zone coverage. And if you want to get the rest of the bunch scheme, go ahead and just shoot me a text. Again, my number is 812 Two one six three six four four. Also, if you're looking to join my PS4 online CFM, it's a ten dollar entry fee, but we are looking. We have a couple of spots that are about to open up in the league, um, and it's a hundred dollar cash prize for the champion. So uh, for the Super Bowl champion. So if you're interested in joining the league, go ahead and just shoot me a text and let me know that as well. Also, if you haven't. Be sure to join the Discord. That link is in the description below. It's where not only you can talk with me, but you can talk with my entire community, Talking Madden 24-7, uh, 365. Would love to have you be a part of our Discord community. We've got a lot of really, really solid members there and a lot of really, really good Madden players. If you're looking for people to lab that can help you get better, that is a great place to be able to start. All right, guys, we are going to catch you guys later on our stream tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So be sure to come by the stream. And we've got a couple of more tip videos that are going to be uploaded here shortly.